At the halfway point of the NFL season, the Redskins are just beginning to gel, and quarterback Sonny Jurgensen is primed for a big day against the defending world champion Chicago Bears. Late in the second period, Jurgensen plays beat the clock and hits the jackpot. Fleet receiver Angela Coya blows by the Bears in an arrow pattern to give Washington a 13-6 lead at intermission. Coya, who has obtained in a trade from the Bears, has the last laugh on Chicago. In the third quarter, Sam Huff, another new Redskin, blitzes Billy Wade off his feet, and the Redskins go into the fourth period all tied. Trying to break the 13-13 standoff, Billy Wade takes to the air, but the Chicago sharpshooter is shot down. Redskin rookie Paul Krause picks off his pass and returns to the Bears 44. Krause, number 26, is a first-year man from Iowa, and he leads the NFL in pass interceptions. The stalemate is shattered when Jurgensen combines with Koya, who retains possession long enough to tally a touchdown, despite the violent protestations of Dave Witzel. The Bears get a quick touchdown and deadlock the game again. Wade throws to Joe Marconi, and we're right back where we started. With four minutes to play, the Redskin Brain Trust plots a plan of action. Sonny Jurgensen transforms the theory into practical application with a screen pass to Don Bossler. <laughs> Riley Matson eradicates Roger LeClaire as Bossler beats a pass to the Chicago 18. Jurgensen triggers the winning touchdown with a shot to Preston Carpenter. Carpenter hammers into the end zone as the resurgent Redskins rally to snatch a victory out of the paws of the world champion Bears. 